congratulations on the win. Do you think the, the with the traffic the last last few laps that uh, you might have been in trouble? Well, we should start off from the beginning. In the dash, when I started on the outside front row, the car wasn't good. And I lucked out to win the dash, Brad lost it a little bit, and I got ahead of him and won the dash. But it wasn't because my car was good, it was because Brad's car was bad. <clears throat> so then in the feature, we, we made some very, very minor changes between the dash and the feature. And when we were hot lapping before the green flag went down in the feature, I called Dave on the radio and I said, whatever we did, the car is really good. So the race started out and I got the lead and then the yellow came out and uh, the six car and I were having a little problem trying to decide who was racing where and I let him go figuring that we're, we're so good that I think we can be, you know, we can pass them later in the race, which I did. When the time came, just drove right by him and kept going and um, then I got into the lap traffic and the lap traffic was keeping me up on the outside. And if you can if you can run your lane and then just have to go to the outside to pass somebody, that's not bad. But when you have to run on the outside for six, eight, ten laps in a row because the lap cars are all on the bottom, then it starts it starts to work on your right rear tire. And at about one the point last you get the, the front stretch wall too. Yeah, I came off a of turn four and the back end just went right off from underneath me and bounced off the wall. And I was not happy with myself when that happened. But it's just a matter of trying to keep the tires under the under the car, you know. I could see everybody else was really struggling. When I was passing the lap cars, I could see how bad they were getting and I'm thinking, you know, we're 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 all in the same racetrack and we're all running the same fight four tires. It's eventually it's gonna catch up to me and it did. About the last 10, 15 laps the car got really bad and trying to stay on the outside and I could see this Steve was coming and it's a lot easier to run second catching somebody than it is to run first staying ahead of second place when you're that far into a race. Right. And it held on to it and uh, beat him by about length. <laughs> Did the track grinding have any effect on how the car I think today? that uh, I think the bottom of the racetrack is really good. But we're having trouble getting off a of four. And they were going to put some... Uh, traction compound on it earlier today and I think they did but it did I don't think they got enough on coming off of four. One and two isn't bad but four is pretty hard to get off. Yeah most of the guys that heard on the radio were all complaining about being loose off of four the whole the yeah. entire day. And that's where I got in trouble when I bounced off the wall. It, it, I got off the corner and I thought you know we're good we're good with it and all of a sudden shoo, the back end comes off from under you and when the back end when the right rear hits the wall and it turns the car and it you know the front wheel hits the wall I thought that might have been the end of the whole thing, but didn't bother the car at all. Not at all. Is it going to so, be any better or worse when, you know, with having to impound the tires that once you have more wear on them, that's going to cause problems? You mean like next week right. or two weeks? Still know how to do it, eh? Yeah, <laughs> with a little luck. Yeah, I was like, I was looking for a black car out there. <laughs> um, we should be. We'll be as good in two weeks as we were today. I don't have any doubts at all. I think they'll do, like you said, adding more of the traction I, compound of the track? I think, you know, last year we ran two tires every every week. And our right front tire, we moved to the right rear. It was as good as anybody's here. And I'm confident that now we're three tires, so we're moving the left rear to the left front, <coughs> being that we ran today we'll leave the left front on the car, but after next week, then the left rear will come to the left front. I don't I don't see no problem at all. When you won last year, and it had been so long between races, and you talked about how, you know, that, that gap, and all having won again so quickly, is it any better or any worse? You mean as far as how I feel about right. it, or how, um, this, this is huge today. Winning that race last fall, there were circumstances there that we got out in the front and what was going on behind us was probably attributed to the fact that we won it by as much as we did. I mean, we're like six seconds ahead on a 12-second racetrack. That tells you a lot. Right. 
but today the car it wasn't like somebody was running side by side and nobody could catch us it was it was a out and out race so i feel really good about it a little more fun that way um it's yeah now it is more standing here right now it's great but when it's going on it's you know you're you're trying to get by the lap cars and they're doing their best to get out of your way you know, everybody does their best to get out of your way same way i would if somebody's lapping me and you get into situations where there's two cars running side by side going down the straightaway and there's nothing you can do you pull up behind them and you just wait and you look in the mirror and you can see the guy behind you is coming and the radio's telling you oh it's five links four links three links two links and then you get by him and then it goes two three four five lengths again and it's it's stressful yeah. I think with you know, the last few years you know small little problems you have with the car and things to be getting better and you've run better and better the last you know year or so I think you have a, a another championship in you it looks real good we're like gonna that. try thank you it's great with the trophy on it <laughs> we're uh, we're gonna run for it and we'll see how things go and if we get into you know if you have issues uh, you get a flat tire or stupid things happen then I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put myself in that position I won six championships and it would be great to win another one but I just don't know if I want to we're gonna we're gonna do the best we can do until we get to the situation or into a position where you haven't really got the opportunity to do it, then we're going to back away from it.